Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to set up web view in into our code level. How we can able to set up our web view and our previous video we saw about how to do it all the things right. <clears throat> now we are going to see for how to test setup. Okay. Now for this we need to Android inspector. We need to open for Android inspector to inspect for our elements. Okay, then CMD to run to connect for our Appium. Okay, Appium iPhone P 44724 is a port number. Even you can uh, pass for 4725 also, it will accept because uh, there is no issue for the ports. Okay. And this is my emulator and I need to click for this particular color note. Okay. Before that, we can able to create one spec file here. New file that is called a web a view.js. Okay. Minimize this. And then I'll copy this entire content because we need to scroll up right. Sorry. Describe. And I need to use for web view suit this is a suit creation and then it to block and here test web view <coughs> and i'm pasting here and this is async apis sorry Async APIs and I can able to copy this and we can now <clears throat> first we need to connect this particular app. We can able to do it anyone just for inspecting for our element purpose. Okay, now if you click this one, there is an accessibility ID that is called color. Just copy <clears throat> coming to here. And we need to make it for a weight, a dollar, and single quotation. Uh, accessibility ID, we are going to use for tilde operator and specify this particular one and dot click operation. Okay. Once we click the operation, okay, now we are able to click here. Then what else we need to do and after clicking that particular one and we need to click for this particular uh, menu also okay if you see here this is the menu if you click the menu we need to get this particular page uh, this particular view and here we need to click for Facebook one okay now I'm going to copy this particular path okay X path I'm going to copying Okay, then I'm going to <clears throat> first I'll wait for some time. I wait browser a dot pass and I'm going to use for thousand seconds. Then await again dollar and single quotation. I'm going to specify my entire path dot click because we need to click for that particular option. Okay. Why these two are coming? <clears throat> okay. And now, after that, again, some time wait. Okay. Once we we are waited for there, and we need to click for this particular element. Okay. Once you refresh here, you can able to get it that page. And if you click, it is too much of uh, export right and even we don't have proper proper values also even see text also it is not presented and nothing is there right if you click the text also if you can able to see right text is presented we can able to click by using for text okay by using text like us is there and we can able to click for by using that <clears throat> await and then a dollar 
single quotation and I'm going to use for star symbol and inside that at the rate text equal to a double quotation and specifying my value dot a click something happened my okay <clears throat> Okay, now we are able to click for that particular one. Okay, once you click this particular one, it will open for browser. It will open for browser. And then we need to verify anything from there. Okay, I can able to validate for this particular login. Okay, by using the text. I'm copying this one. If you see, we can't able to do it for anything from here. And you can we need to see for web from here, and we can able to now. This is for our web view. It will be look like this one. Okay, and we need to inspect and we need to verify. For this, I'm going to do for this particular button, login button, verification. Okay. <clears throat> I'll take for some text and I'll verify for that particular one. Okay. Now I'm removing this one. Login is there. Then we can able to go ahead here. <clears throat> I'll wait some time. Two thousand seconds, and we can able to wait. Expect, okay, and expect a dollar. <coughs> Hi, here single quotation and a similar format of double forward slash and star symbol, and insert that at the rate text equal to double quotation. Log in, okay. And, and here I'm going to check for is to be to be displayed to be displayed <clears throat> I'm going to check for this one okay now I need to run for this particular one okay I'm going to use for npx wdio run dot configuration wdio android dot configuration spec and I'm going to use for my web view dot js file. Okay. Now, oh sorry, uh, before that we need to do for this all the backward. Okay. <clears throat> now we can able to see our script will be failed. Why we'll see in the last. Even you can see the actions here. Once it is done, the performance. Oh, sorry, our script will be failed because starting only because it is a witness dark August. Here it is there Monday. Oh shit. Sorry, my bad. Wednesday. August 16th. Okay. <clears throat> Sometimes the browser will work expected one. Sometimes it will not work. Okay. This is I'm using for Google Nightwatch Android, right? That's why it is taking like that. And if you see some different uh, apps will work for a different way. Now color notes, click and click 
and it is open for here. Now our, our script will be failed because of login, it is not presented. So oh, it is already passed, but it is thrown some exception. No such element exception you can able to see, right? No, the element it is failed because of no such element is presented here. Okay. Why means because this particular this is a browser. It is not in a inside the app. It is completely separate browser. Then how we can able to access app to a browser that we'll see into a later video session. Okay. I hope it until this you like it. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe and share to your friends and colleagues. Thank you.